In menopause, your cholesterol will rise. It should rise. It acts as an antioxidant. If you think about it, we need uh, protection against heart disease and cancers. So actually, our body will produce more cholesterol in order to give us extra protection. It's required for brain and joint function and to produce bile. So we know that it's vitally important for lots of different functions in the body. And research shows that females with lower levels of cholesterol are much more likely to experience heart disease or they're at risk of heart disease, strokes, heart attacks, and a much higher chance of depression. What causes heart disease? Our vegetable oils are a major, major part of the problems we're experiencing in terms of lifestyle diseases these hydrogenated vegetable oils. I mean, they're very susceptible to oxidation. So typically vegetable oils are heat extracted, which damages them straight away. Too much fructose. So we've spoken about fructose being a fruit sugar and also high fructose corn syrup is another thing that's added to a lot of processed foods. High consumption of grains triggers the process creating those very low density lipoproteins. Foods cooked at high temperature produce compounds, which then lead to inflammation. Smoking harms heart and blood vessels. Inactivity, of course, and in fact, in reverse, HDL actually is boosted by doing more physical activity. Emotional stress leads to a high uh, white blood cell count. That in turn can cause arthrosclerosis or plaque rupture and heart attacks. 